حق جوردن يا احلى بجوردن انت حطيت لنا المنيو انت يا معلم انت معلم هي از ذا بيست هي Good morning everybody, welcome to another episode of Journey to 30. Today I am stopping by the restaurant equipment market to finalize the purchases and everything, all the small little pieces that we need for Aklat Mediterranean Grill and Cafe. So let's get to it, see you guys in a minute. We've created an equipment list and I've had it for a while now. And we've been shopping, whether it's online or at multiple different stores. But we came to this one to put the final stamp on it. The prices that I've currently got, gotten to see if we can get it a little bit cheaper. We're finalizing the flooring now. And then the paint on the walls will be going up next week. So it's time to get it done. I can put a nice piece of stainless steel in the, in the bottom of the counter. Also, you know, they all hook up together nice. Yeah, this is nice. And then the granite we're using. Uh, yeah. All right. Now that we've wrapped up the restaurant equipment, I'm here at Souk for just a couple minutes. Haven't been here in a couple days just because of how many meetings I've been having at the office. So let's get inside, wrap up, and then get back to the office. So we just stopped by here, Georgia went at college. I was supposed to be in one of those seats, but actually took the decision to transfer to Georgia State University from where I graduated about two years ago. Today, I'm here for a completely different reason, and it's to come back, you know, as I'm building the team for the media company, one of the first places I thought to come was right back here where I once was, and look for ambitious, determined people that would be willing to join me on this journey to 30. Things do take time, but if you're on top of it and you are aware of what's going on, then you can better enhance the overall um, outcome. And then we went to Souk, had a little internal meeting with the manager there, making some minor adjustments to the menu. We are actually adding pizza to uh, Souk's menu, so that should be good because it's gonna be a really special type of pizza since nobody in our area does pizza with shawarma. As much as you plan, you need to continue to plan uh, because every day is the unexpected can happen and you have got to be prepared at all times to face whatever circumstances come your way. Time flies, it truly does fly. Just yesterday I feel like I was starting this company uh, in 2013. Make sure you're maximizing every single moment because before you know it, time will continue to go on and you would have not moved if you're contemplating what you want to do you have to do it try adapt and then you know keep constantly adapting to what's relevant uh, to your market to your customers or to um, what's relevant in 2017 period just made it let's lock the car get inside, put up these menus, and get out of here. So today I want to remind everybody to never ever quit. The real failure happens when you stop trying. You have got to try to learn, so never stop trying and never stop learning. The problem becomes is when you're continuously learning new things and you're not executing on them. 
when you know that there could be a better way to do something and you're not doing it, well then that's on you. So stop complaining about it. Me today, I had a small issue which was, you know, something that I just couldn't figure out about the POS system over there. Adding a new thing to our POS system, it just it just wasn't functioning right. And then it turned out to be a small issue where I couldn't put a number as one of the first um, you know letters or characters on the menu. So I figured it out, I implemented it, I changed it, and then simply done, it was fixed. But I didn't stop trying. It took me five times resetting the whole system to get it right and it got done right. So make sure you're continuously trying to learn, trying to try, and never ever quit. Amir, what time is it? It's time to close and you're not the last one leaving this time. That's unusual. Just made it home after leaving Souk right at close and it's yet another 18 hour day.